Hello everybody, welcome back. Uh, we are 15 seconds away from departure, so let's close that door we were looking out and get ready to shut the doors. Let's run the announcement. Uh, let's see. This train is ready to part. This train is it's ready to depart. Please stand clear of the doors. Let's go! We did it, I think. Announcements. Please don't. Hey, look, we have a whistle. That's the gayest whistle I've ever heard. up all four. We're not that fat. Please be Paddington. Please be Paddington. Please be Paddington. They start announcing the next station at 200 meters out. What? Where are we? Paddington. What? This is no, it's not. I don't even get that. So right now we're here, and we're going here. This is Paddington. Change here for the Baker Blue Line and National Rail Services. This is a Circle Line train to Edgware Road. I hate this thing. So our arrival is in about a half hour, so I'll just let the episode run to that. <laughs> Better say the next station is Bayswater. Us with that right now. Whew. Good thing of thank God for emergency brakes. I have thirty seconds to mess with this. No, it's not. We're on the interrail. Where are we? Bayswater. And Goldhawk Road is not our start station. No, not Baker Street. No, this way. Oh, I think I saw... Bayswater, right there. Oh! I see. Sadly, the game has no idea where we terminate. We are keeping to schedule a little bit. 
if you look down here at departure, the logged is 803. Notting Hill Gate is our next stop. Right. <coughs> so we're just gonna run till we get there. start that announcement 200 meters out. We leave and now. three stops. Hurry up. We're late. We're still on the platform, aren't we? Yeah, we're still on the platform. Actually, we're not running that far behind, because High Street can even sit up for a minute. Really? No change? This is a big station. I would have expected some kind of change announcement. So we have a minute to sit here. What the heck? It's like, nope! These actually do, apparently according to NerdCubed, that these do look like proper ads, except for one. The one that says, Hungry? Eat pizza! <sighs> well, this train is ready to depart. Let's go! Let's -a go! Does the speed limit change? It goes down to 30. No, 25! It might go back up to 30 though. Gloucester Road. Yeah, it goes back up to 30. For some reason, a lot of these straight tunnels have small speed limits. For some reason, it's weird. I 
to see that. Is that effective for us? No, that must be for track changers. Oh no, it is for us! We leave the next station in 45 seconds. We haven't even gotten there yet. The next station is Gloucester Road. Gloucester Road. The Dang it, I stopped talking in my British accent for some reason. Gloucester Road. I could really open the doors on both sides, but... Get out. Oh wait, this is the fun looking station. Open the doors because we're gone. Let those guys back there get on. Alright, let's close the doors, let's go. Come on, I, uh, there we go. This mouse is really sensitive. And it's not just my mouse, it's the game that's sensitive to my mouse. London Underground apologize for this delay. I kinda know these numbers now, by heart. London Underground apologizes for the delay of this service. Okay, now our limit's 35. Hey, wave high! No, don't look at gauges! Wave high! The next Dang it. Is South Kensington. Oop, slow down. For the district and Piccadilly lines. Exit for the Alright, what's our next stop? Oh! Oh yeah, we changed tracks here, never mind. <laughs> I was seeing that train, I was like, oh my gosh! It's like, why do we have a green signal? And he's turning anyway. <laughs> Sloan Square is our next stop. We leave there in two and a half minutes. I ran a subway service, I just throw the trains out at any time, like, eh, you leave when you leave. They get there when they get there, they leave when they leave. They sit there to stay there for a minute. They're set to stay there for two minutes, or whatever. And they go when they go. But since they'd be robotic trains, with no driver like this, I London not underground still tells us, can't believe they do. Close that door first so nobody gets in here. 
Let's open this door and go say hi to everybody. Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm the driver of the train. I'm not at the top front seat. Ooh, getting a little close. And by close, I mean your foot is now his foot. These are really nicely done. Even this! It even has rust stains on it. Huh. We need to get better than that. Everybody, I'm the driver of the train. We will be leaving soon without me at the wheel. No, just kidding. I wish you could do that. Just ride your train around. Hey, when do we leave? 30 seconds. I sat down just in time. Oh, don't look back. Close the door. There. Let's go! So we'll be there in 13 minutes. This video will be 13 minutes longer, if not 14, for the outro. Or it'll be about. 15 or 16, because I have to de-set up the train, or set down the train, or whatever you call it. Thinking. Okay. Now these are the tunnels that have the higher speed limits when you bank through them. But the straight shots are 25. Th th what's wrong with you, London Underground? You hurt my brain. Really? What the heck? Okay, so the next station's right here in Victoria. Went to a school. Went to school with a girl named Victoria. She's popular in London. I didn't realize this. Oh, there's a new train. Uh, I'm driving a C stock. I don't know what kind of stock that is. They tell you what kind of stock you're driving in the tutorial. Is how I know. That was just so confusing to get all out from the station. We're not going to Tower Hill. We're in a mansion house and stopping there. And shut the doors. So this, if we're gonna bank around this. We would bank. We would bank around this corner if we were going 40 miles an hour. Yet straight shots are like 10 or 20. Like there's a closed platform. I can understand the closed platform, but that's 10 miles through there. Closed platform, 10 miles an hour. Nobody's working there. Jeez, serious. Like seriously, what the heck? Oh. Before I forget, I apologize for the delay of the final portal episode. It is going to be the final episode. I do mean that. Um, but I am I'm very sorry to announce that uh, when I tried to edit that video, sound was missing. I couldn't get it. I restarted the computer, tried that. There was still no sound, so I will be re-recording that at a different time. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. That will be re-recorded, I promise. Move up a little bit. St. James is? Rust all right on these signs. I wonder how they made this game. They just ride the London Underground around for f like a week and just take pictures of all the stations and then stations come home and then just like uh, animate it kind of like. Because <laughs> actually, 
A lot of these stations actually look like a picture. Like this thing here that looks like a picture. It does not look like it was animated. Go. And that, that kind of looks like a picture a little bit. Like, see, see, look here, this is a perfect example. It is a straight shot, and it's 30 miles an hour, I'm speeding. Westminster. You did not just say Avi. <sighs> they make computers so dumb these days. This is Westminster. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform. Change here for the Jubilee Line. Exit here for Westminster Abbey and Houses of Parliament. This is a Circle Line train to Houses really of Parliament via Embankment and Tower Hill. Of course, it's not the best idea to leave right now, because you'll get ahead of schedule and you're running the red signals, other trains, and possibly have a wreck. You know, like getting over. Go. If you're not on the train, screw you. Three rails looks like it'd be normal. But no! Four rails! Oh. Like what? You throw two trains on here at the same time? Oh, more speeding again. You know, we were looking for, um, whatchamacallit, uh, King's Cross St. Pancras. I've always wanted to go there. It seems so cool just to go to King's Cross. You know, a huge fire started at King's Cross because of an uh, irresponsible smoker threw a match down on the escalator, lighting a blaze dirty oil. Uh, it started a campfire on the escalator, and then they didn't know it and the oil underneath heated up and then all of a sudden <laughs> and the escalator turned into a flamethrower <laughs> right into the ticket hall and killing everybody well it didn't kill everybody but I think it killed one or two people I mean the firefighters couldn't even get in there there was so much smoke it was a flamethrower several people caught on fire though uh you know what I should put the link to that it's a TV show I was watching it was a uh, uh, seconds from disaster. That's right. Uh, that was on that show. I'm gonna find that YouTube video somewhere and put it in the description. Because that was a good a little show. It told you exactly how it caught on fire. Let's close the doors a minute. Uh, they even used the subway to carry away the bodies and the injured. Because they would fall down, back down the escalator. Oh, other escalators. Um, so yeah. That happened. So the firefighters eventually did get in there. Oh, I can't remember. But I feel like... I th think they lost their chief in there, actually. I can't remember. It's been a long time since I watched the episode. But yeah, I'm gonna put that in the description. You should watch it. It's really cool. Everybody's like, Oh, this is probably the train. Because in the tube... These trains are up to the ceiling. Uh, they're so tall that the wind rushes straight through. You know when a train's coming on the London Underground because of a wish of air. Uh, so, 
Yeah, that's what they thought and flew into the campfire to go blaze up the escalator. And yes, fires are influenced. Called fuel pressure. Exit here for oh crap, I'm late. Let's go. This is a line train to Why was I late here? I was doing so good. These people are like, no, come back. Oh, Mansion House is our next station. Cool. last station is our last stop. Oh, really? Uh, we have four minutes to sit here. Oh, dang it, that means Blackfriars ahead of us. So that means I need to announce and we get up here when it says Blackfriars is next. This is that closed station I was talking about where you go ten miles through. Here, I'm actually speeding. So this is the station that's closed, it's not open. It's actually got a lot of graffiti on it. Yeah. A lot of horrible things have happened on the London Underground, actually. Oh, we can go. There's no point going that fast, because we're just going to come to the station right now. What's oh, 30. The next station is See, there's a 20 limit. The nope, not Blackfriars. That means the next station is Mansion House. We're done. I think this is the end of the line. Literally, the end of the line. Crap, people are waiting here. Well, I'm gonna have to tell them to get off my train. Hey, I did it! Keep that on for a minute. Nope, not that way. That way. Is it already up? Oh, it is. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, no, we can't switch it all the way up until this is down. And then we'll do this. No, not that way. Score! We got an 84! It's actually better than last time. The parcel schedule has not been capped. Not all cars. Really? It was at the very end. The yes, I know that. The braking was too hard. I always brake too hard. So anyway, guys, that was London Underground Simulator. Uh, tell me if you want to see more, because there are a lot of missions. Let me show you. We're not going to do another one right now. So I think I'm over time, and my cat is snoring. Like, there's this one, was, uh, this was the one that I screwed up on on another take. Uh, I was like, oh my god, no, it didn't, I didn't screw up, the game screwed up, like, it stopped in the middle of the track, like, for some reason, what the heck? And this one, you have to drive, uh, like, really slow, slow, collecting, you need to take one to the depot, 
uh, you have to take your train to the depot. This is another one for those. You get on a train and drive somewhere else. It's these. Uh, so that's about it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, and comment. And, um... I'm sorry about the last portal episode. I need to re-record that. So I'll get on that right away. Thank you for watching, everybody.